Okay, everyone, rest up. We'll head out at first light, all right? I appreciate you giving us a chance to rest, Jesse. I hate to admit it, but I needed this. Yo, we haven't really gotten a chance to chat yet. Oh, hello. So, you're Ellie's protege? <laughs> She's a piece of work, isn't she? Always thinking about all her redstone stuff. Always trying to show off how smart she is. I gotta ask, what's up with you guys? Why do you fight so much? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. We've been in too many tight situations together, and we've just never gotten along. They Different got a little romance going on. All that. You know. Anyway, thanks for having my back before. I do appreciate it. How you liking being the leader of this little pack? I know I haven't been around here long, but even I can tell there's some unrest in the ranks. Huh. Especially between Axel and, uh, what's her name? Uh, Olivia. Me and my team are the best. We can get through anything. Huh. Wish my gang had that kind of commitment. Hope you're right. Anyway, small fry, let's get some sleep. We've got a long walk ahead of us in the morning. I'm not sure how the rest of you are feeling, but I feel fantastic. I think that a little sleep is just what I needed. <laughs> Wish I felt as good as you sound. I'm still feeling a little under the weather. Uh, guys? This is exactly what I was afraid of. It caught up with us. Holy uh -oh. stack burglars! You weren't kidding! No. Not again. So there was there was no point to waiting then because we're still fighting the monsters. <sighs> All right. Fuck. Got one. Oh, I don't think I have any arrows left. Haha! <laughs> Take it. Come on, we gotta get out of here. I am getting very tired of this wither storm. Agreed. Not again. Not again. Soren's isn't much farther. We can make it. Soren's place has got to be just ahead. Come on! Soren really lived down here? It's so far from... Anyone. Enchanting, isn't it? <coughs> What's going on with her? Yeah, and I'm really not feeling those columns. Ah, oh, come on! It's fine! Look! Woo! <laughs> Stupid. This is, we're gonna regret this. Okay. Oh, that is deep. That is very, very deep. Uh oh. Oh no, Reuben. I got you, Reuben. Jesse, you 
okay? That was crazy. No. Looks like Ruben thought so too. I'm more curious why the ground kept moving. It's so weird. Whoa. Look. Bunch of Endermen. What is that? Endermen. What are they doing down there? I'm not sure. But I'm glad we're not a part of it. Come on. We should get out of here. Olivia and the others already went ahead. architecture it's incredible looks like the others already swam across guess we better catch up ah uh, thing in the water okay we're good oh be quiet it's just a pointless building that's all i'm saying i mean look at madness if an artist that's it i'm going once again Falls to me to take care of everything. I'll find this super TNT myself. Oh, no, no, no. You do not get to be the one who walks away. That's it. I'm going. Jesus see, Christ. I'm walking away too now. Super TNT. Here I go. This is elementary school. It's We're in elementary school right now. Full when they keep kicking the glass over. And I thought they were doing so well. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. Bickering is kind of their deal. But hopefully they'll work things out and get on with the important stuff. What are we going to do now? Where should we go? Let's figure it out. Oh, I'm moving. Is there... Oh, okay. Soren the Builder. Magnus the Rogue. Eligard the Engineer. Gabriel the Warrior. Now, ah, there we go. If they made a statue of me, I wouldn't choose that pose. I'd look like this. Hey, Petra. Hey. You okay? What is her deal? She must have seen something really disturbing when the wither was attacking. Hey, Jesse? Yeah? It's Petra. She... I don't know. Doesn't seem right. I tried asking, but she... Well, maybe she'll talk to you? Nope. I already tried that. Didn't work. The Can I still talk TNT to you? Thing. Feels like such a long shot. Well, we're trusting Eligard on this one, so maybe our chances are better, right? Probably not. Follow Magnus or follow Eligard. Uh, Eligard just seems like she's more stable and intelligent, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna follow her. Petra? She probably won't okay? get me killed. I'm sorry. I don't mean to worry you. I've just got something I want to discuss with you in private. But let's split up. bad about ditching everyone else, but I just wanted to talk to you about this alone. It's a little tough to talk about. Hey, whatever it is, I trust you. You can tell me. 
Thanks for being so understanding. You got me away from the wither storm. But I'm worried that I didn't get away soon enough. What? What? It showed up not too long after you saved me. What happened? The wither made you sick? Do you know what wither is? The wither? Of course, we've been... No, Jesse. Just wither. Or wither sickness, I guess. And I feel like it's just gonna keep getting worse. Well, we're gonna go back and tell the others we can get help. You can't tell anyone about this. Ah! Creeper! Why can't I say anything? Grab my hand, pull you up. She's weak. She's weak, yeah, she can't do it. Jesse, I just couldn't. I'm sorry. Jesse? Go and find the others. Hopefully, you can find a way to get down to me or something. Okay. Stay safe. I'll find a way down to you. No, you won't. <laughs> See ya, piggy. Okay, get the amulet before it falls over. Uh-huh. I'm close to Ivor. That's what that means. I would... I would imagine. Or it's just giving me a flashlight. <laughs> that's, I guess that's possible. The amulet actually has two functions. I don't know if you knew. Fulfill prophecies and help you see in the dark. Hey, asshole, where are you? Wow. So is this like a library? With a lot of light. Ah! I found a thing here. This does stuff, it looks like. Ah, okay. I didn't see that. Oh, that's ominous. Not there he is. Useful in here. He has to. Why would he have so many books? Is he just collecting them? He can't have read all of these. Uh, hello there. <gasps> you trying to interfere with my plans again? I see. Your tenacity is commendable, yet misguided. You found your way in here, so now you may find it back out again. I found the rest of the order. What good will that do? I'm here with the order to find Soren's Super TNT. We're gonna take down your Witherstorm. The order? <laughs> Believe me, that plan will blow up in their faces in more ways than one. They cannot help you. But me? I choose not to. Out of my way. Move! Fine. Oh, you're not going anywhere. Hmm. Oh, no. you escaped. <laughs> oh, shit. Foolish girl. Shut up. I don't care what you have to say. I'm just going to take you down. Ah, Patrick, let him go. It's not worth it. Sorry, Jesse. D. I didn't escape one monster just to let another get away. Ah! 
Alright. I don't want to kill the guy. God damn it. Alright. I'm the only one who can stop the wither storm. Not you, not the order. Don't make yourselves the villains in my story. Really? We're doing this? You're not going anywhere. This could have all been avoided. If you want to stop me, you'll have to catch me first. Jesse, look out! Oh You're shit. Not out here that easy, Ivor. <laughs> I'm like the wind. Oh. I'll cut through you if I had to. Don't tempt your fate. God damn! Jesse's turning into a badass. You didn't have to go this way, Jesse. You could have just let me go. <laughs> now you see me. Now you. <laughs> it's one of his invisibility potions. He could be anywhere. Vanish all you want, slime ball. You're still not going anywhere. Uh uh. Rail, Ivor. We're not letting you get away with this. This one's on you, you puffed up fool. Uh uh. Uh oh. There's no time for this. You're in trouble. Jesse! Even more of you? Will this parade of useless babblers never cease? What's going on? We found Ivor. Stopped him. Jesse did, anyway. False. You have stopped nothing. Query, have you ever seen the effects of a splash potion of slowness? <laughs> Shit. That they can destroy the Wither Storm, but they are mistaken, and it will cost them their lives. Wow, that was it! Damn. Next time on Minecraft Story Mode. In pursuit of answers, all our heroes found in Sauron's armory was deceit and treachery. Locked in a dark chamber deep in Sauron's mountain, as the Order of the Stone rides off towards near certain doom, our heroes must ask themselves, would they find a way out of this dark tomb? Is there any way to cure Petra's wither sickness? Would they find a way to defeat the wither storm? Or will they remain trapped as it continues its ravenous rampage across the entire world? Only time will tell. All right, so that was the end to Minecraft Story Mode Episode 2. That was really short. It was barely over an hour. I am very surprised. Um, well, I guess not totally surprised. This episode only came out like two weeks after the last one did, which I'm kind of perplexed about. That, that kind of leads me to believe that they already mostly have this story structured out as to how they're going to do things. And so from that perspective maybe this makes sense for them. Maybe they're not wanting to tell, like, this giant story, like with, uh, you know, Game of Thrones or Tales from the Borderlands or something. Maybe they're more comfortable with just doing, like, hour-long episodes or something. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I mean, I don't know. Like, I enjoyed this episode. It wasn't... 
uh, there wasn't like anything that would make me go like, oh, that was great. It was kind of like it was decent. You know, it was a decent episode. It was passable. Um, I did. There was nothing really that I loved about it. There wasn't anything I disliked about it. It was just, it was just good. It was decent. You know, I, I guess I'm try still kind of furthering the narrative with uh, Jesse's character. I'm starting to learn the character names. Isn't that impressive? Uh, but yeah, I guess I'm trying to further that whole narrative of him, you know, believing he thinks he knows what a hero is and then kind of recognizing what it actually takes to be one as time goes on. Um, I don't know. I, like, it seems like that narrative is still open and it's still something I can do. Um, it, I, I'm starting to wonder as to whether or not they're actually going to make Ivor a sympathetic character or if he just is like the main villain aside from the Wither. I don't really know what they're doing with that. Um, we'll probably find out within the next episode or so. Um, but yeah, I mean, overall, I think it was it was um, a decent episode. You know, one thing I will say is that a lot of people have been complaining, or at least I've noticed, a lot of people have been complaining that they have decided to make this a, a thing, the Minecraft story mode thing, as opposed to, you know, continuing Walking Dead. Like, so many people are bitching and moaning about the fact there's no Walking Dead Season 3. It's like, oh no, you mean we can't play the other game where whatever you do doesn't matter? We have to play this one? Like, it doesn't really make a difference. I don't know. I, I yeah, Had I not been exposed to the massive amount of criticism that, that uh, this game has gotten in comparison to the others, I would have the same basic opinion in comparison to, the, uh, to every other Telltale game, with the exception of maybe Tales from the Borderlands, where I'm just like, yeah, I mean, it's all right. <laughs> Like, there's nothing inherently wrong with it. it. The decisions you make mostly don't matter, and that's just kind of what there is to it. Like, I don't think that this is worse than, or if it is any worse. Like, it's not all that much worse than The Walking Dead um, in comparison to other Telltale games. I think people are just overreacting um, to, to what's going on in these games. I, I don't know. I just feel like there's a lot of unjust and unfair criticism towards this game in particular in comparison to others. Um... So yeah, I don't know. Like, I, there's not really very much I can say on the story. Things happened. Some things, I suppose. I do like that they're starting to make Jesse's character more badass. I thought that was really cool. He, uh, in in relief of Petra, who's clearly weakened, he basically became the action hero of this episode. Like, he was the one that was able to take on one of the former members of the Order, and I think that's really neat. I think that's a, a cool um, little little moment that there was near the end there, where uh, we had that little fighting scene. I liked it. Thought it was cool. Um, I don't know. I really can't think of anything else I really want to say. Uh, I enjoyed the episode. Thought it was alright. And uh, yeah, that's about it. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, please be sure to like and subscribe and all that. And I will see you guys next time.